Hi Gemini, it's Elle here to do your August 2019 general reading. It's a general reading so it will not resonate with every Gemini who views the video. But if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Okay, so we've got five cards pulled for the present. And then we have the overall energy at the bottom of the deck which is temperance okay so the gemini may be in a space of trying to rectify salvage compromise put back together um marry the two um in a situation it could be romantic it could be platonic it could be business related career let's see we have the High Priestess, the Six of Swords, the Lovers, the Hermit, the Hangman. Okay. This might be a situation where the Gemini has to make a choice in regards to, you know, what they love to do and then what brings them money. So maybe love and money. This also may be a choice of two people. But this is a choice. The choice. Um, something has been brought to the Gemini. Or, or brought to your attention. Or, or someone. You and someone else. Or you and something else. It's at a head now. You have to make the choice. In regards to what you do next. Um. It looks like the Gemini is looking for direction with the Hermit card. You may be separated from a particular person, place, or thing. Whatever it may be, it says that the answer, you already know the answer. You're looking outside for, for what is within. You know what to choose. You know which way to go. You're looking at past experience either with this particular person or some... or past experience of life and you're trying to reflect on what it is you should do it says that currently in order to um, to have wish fulfillment or have whatever it is that you really really want um, it says you don't have what you want wish fulfillment isn't exactly um, with you it's right you're right at the brink of it this could be in career this could be in love and romance um, but it says your lack of commitment is what's holding you back or your fear of commitment your fear of committing yourself completely to one position making a choice now this could be of committing yourself to one person uh, one job one career whatever it may be but it says that you have some natural given talents um, that you kind of repress or you repress because you don't know what to do with it or what to do with them. You don't know how to cultivate those natural given talents to where it puts you in a place where you're um, content with it. Making money, you know, moving forward. You don't know what to do with it. you don't know if you should walk away from a particular person there's a lot of mystery and a lot of mystery considering this person this is a woman this is feminine energy she knows a lot she's very wise you, you just you can't figure her out for some of you 
it says in order to have what you want you're going to have to shift your perspective and you're going to have to make sacrifice and that sacrifice is going to rest in permanence so whatever choice you make here it's going to be a permanent decision or choice um, make sure you choose righteously make sure you choose what gets you to the path you want to be on make sure you make the choice where there isn't a sense of entrapment after you know committing yourself to whatever position let's see what this is about pull a card okay the courage moving okay let's see some of you have to have the courage to move away from a position that's just not going to get you what you want there's there may be a, a, a sense of um, codependency here good sex and, and you find a particular person or position useful there is a sense of usefulness with this person or place or thing but at the same time it also makes you just because it's useful doesn't mean that it's it's good for you this person is helpful a good Samaritan or they've had your back or they do things you may be older than you you younger than them or vice versa you're unsure you're gonna have to have the courage to what's this courage card okay to either have the new beginning have the victorious new beginning a severed ties with something else speak your truth you're gonna have to have the courage to do that moving what is this about ace of cups new home two new stars here definitely some Gemini's are out there they're at a crossroads either in love or career in love it's it's really about making the choice about what it is what's best for you and what you want to do in regards uh, to love also you've done the planning here now it says are you going to fully walk in whatever position you've been doing planning in regards to uh, the universe is asking that you make the commitment to to whatever it is you know moving some of you could be moving towards love moving towards a new home whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Moving. Okay. five pentacles moving towards a new could be a new home You want to uh, move in towards a relationship. But you, you you have words for someone. You have you feel like you need to lay down the law. You also there may be a lack of confidence in something moving forward, but you still want to move in it. There may have been yeah, pettiness, childish games played. Someone's making an offer to you. 
or at least the offer of, of words, words you've heard before, is making you conflicted. What's the advice for the Gemini in regards to a particular person? You've had a significant history with this person. Pettiness and drama ensue here, but there's a lot of romance, childish you know, behavior, games. What's the advice for the Gemini? Okay. All right. Okay. The advice here for you is... Ask your friends, ask helpful people. It looks like you want to offer something to someone or someone wants to offer something to you. You want to merge life with someone, but you're so unsure and unclear for whatever reason. But it says ask the probing questions of... Um, You're going to have to be very clear with them in regards to what you want and how you deal with them. There's going to have to be some rule, some law laid here. What you expect in, from a wife or from a, a, a husband. It looks like a definite home move. It's almost as if you want to offer someone something. It says that the offer is good. And that you, you could. This could work. But you too. Have to get clear on something. If this is love. You have to get clear on what it is. The guidelines. Both of you have to be clear that. It's you and the other person in this and not you and some you know and several other people yeah you want to know if this person is dating other people still keeping options open before you offer anything or before you accept the offer it's a long time coming. You've been wanting to offer this. Or you've been wanting to accept an offer like this. But you're trying to be strong in doing so. Either giving the offer or accepting it. Because you guys have been through a lot. There's a lot of compatibility here. But then there's a lot of nuances that you guys have to get through and work through. Okay, let me leave you with some advice. Let's see. Success. Okay. Yeah, I see that there's a, there's a level of success romance didn't I say that lots of romance here with a particular person um, three of cups a peaceful resolution it is you guys have to get through whatever it is you're going through Ask others for help. Did I say that? Ask your friends. And reconsider. Okay? Alright. So, Gemini, this is your reading. It looks like you're just in a, a place of being on a fence about something you really want. But then there's, like, problems. But there's something you really want. It's nothing major. It's just about you putting on your big girl panties or your big boy underwear and really facing it. In speaking and talking and getting clear about what you expect, what you will ex accept, 
um, be eager, okay? Be eager in making this happen. Gemini, thank you for tuning in. Um, if you feel like you need a personal reading, go over to the website and book your reading there. Make sure you use the coupon code below. Also, you can get a one question reading. That's $5. I think it's $6.66. Don't quote me. It's over at the website, but it's under $10. Um, thank you, Gemini. Um, know that I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care.